Alright. The futility of a sales pitch. I notice that most grown-ups that I know personally like manipulating youth with sales tactics. They wrongfully assume that the sales pitch is a Jedi mind trick that can bypass anybody's moral code. Part of what makes the sales tactic work is that you're creating a time-sensitive affirmation to put pressure on your subject. Subject being the best word choice I have at the moment. College advisors, military recruiters, employers, doctors, even family. It's all the same. They see a reprobate or a dimwit, and they capitalize on the potential sucker. The fact is that so long as you maintain a moral standard and a low time preference, these tactics function merely as a nuisance. And that's pretty much, as far as the script goes, a loose outline. It is an issue that I notice and I find it irritating, but it's also not a very difficult issue to deal with. Because after all, power is ultimately yours and this whole sales tactic basis is predicated on the fact that you don't trust their ass and the information they're giving you is untrustworthy. So it's a lose-lose situation. They're not being put in a position of power and they're bullshitting their way through, so... It's not that difficult. It takes a very weak person. Intellectually high or low. Sometimes even being intellectually superb is a problem with these things so long as you don't maintain your low time preference and your moral standard if you forget about those you're in trouble anyways this is Mr. Wonka 7 and suck my dick